It is our understanding that they've gone with a 4-5-1. Well, this setup, Peter, can be very defensive if that midfield is in place purely to form a protective layer in front of the back four. But it can also be the launch pad to very quick counter-attacks. If you can offer pace and accuracy on the front foot, it can have a, a devastating effect, actually, at the offensive end of the pitch, too. There's the whistle, and here we go. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? This guy, Skriniar, is a true powerhouse defender of real pedigree, Peter. Someone who can make a, a great defensive leader, being so imposing physically and indeed tactically. I suppose he could be smoother in one-on-ones, but he's still an excellent all-round defender. OK, interesting. Looking for options for movement. There's the shot! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Ferreira Carrasco over to the other side. It's Azar. That was good pressing. Forced the error to put an end to it before things could get even more threatening. Interesting ball. Well, the defence proved infallible then. But that won't be the last they'll see of him. Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Then Donka is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Slovakia making a good start. Nice level of intensity in their play. He is just caressing the ball. Rusnak. Good spot, he's seen the run. Aimed in towards the centre. for Tongan and the pass is intercepted Rusnak oh this is a great position played up towards the front line well this is turning out to be a lively old game yeah, especially in those wide areas, something the team have clearly identified as being the more productive of the channels. And that's a throw-in. And it's Carrasco. Torkan Azar. That's Dendonka. Neither side yet able to find the net. Now looking to orchestrate a counter. Over to the left. De Ketelara. Oh, they can break here. Lukaku. That's shapes to shoot! Oh, that is rather wayward. Well, we were anticipating this. They're very much set up for the counter-attack, and I don't see it changing anytime soon. Ferreira Carrasco. Trossard, De Ketelara, Ops for safety, and it's for Tongan. Played in with accuracy. That has been cut short. Pekarik. 
Rusnak. There will be a throw in. De Bruyne. Castagna. And it's for Tongan. Moved on forwards. Oh, that's a key interception. Chance to break. And it's Lukaku. Skriniar wins the duel this time. Played out towards the right wing. He's left his man. Well, that looks a foul. Yeah, referee's given it. Can he latch on to this? Oh, nice touch. Lobotka. Out to the left it goes. Crossed in. And he's cut it out. And the half-time whistle goes. Well, there it is, half-time. Not a bad watch by any means. And the efforts of both sides have been good, but neither have been able to penetrate. And so we reach the break, and the game remains goalless. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. A tight old game so far. Can that change now? That is a brilliant interception. Trossard. Now for Tongan. It's an inviting looking ball that. De Ketelara. Trossard. Lukaku. He can get that clear. Gets away from his opponent. Spread out to the left. He's got away. Oh, sweet feet. And the ball is out of play. Final checks on the touchline. A change about to occur. Ferreira Carrasco. Castagna. That's Tielemans. Sends it crossfield. And the counter is on. He's found real chance. It's in. And that is the goal we've all been yearning for. And that really is so, so impressive. Well, from the moment he got involved, he looked as if he'd go all the way. Terrific. Slovakia get themselves into the lead. Well, listen, a few words of advice and encouragement from the manager during the break can often straighten things out, and it's paid off here. Played out to the left flank. He's shifting through the gears here. Well, that is a good challenge from him.
Belgium can counter promptly here. Now it's Lukaku. Oh, that is a nice touch. And it's Carrasco. Now it's Trossard. Well, that tackle was certainly sturdy. Belgium showing a little more urgency now, and to be honest, Peter, this is what's required. They're coming again and again. Well, the question now is whether they can sustain it. Slovakia are more than happy to defend deep now. They've decided that it's not worth taking any more risks. Slovakia, on the other hand, are left with no choice but to risk everything and to go for it. A oh, lovely Fidi is such a good move. Massive leap! It's run loose. Who's going to get there? It's gone for a throw in. Oh, there is some activity down on the touchline. It seems there's going to be a change. Carrasco. And now the hit. Oh, denied brilliantly. Well, to be honest, he shouldn't have spilled that in the first place, but he recovered it really quickly, so no harm done. Well, here is the raid we were told to expect. Luca Bacchio. Well, from experience, I can tell you he'll get a lot of stick for getting that one wrong. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. And it's Carrasco. Just eases him off the ball. A real chance to break. Last ditch defending, but that'll do. Slovakia surely have to be commended for their drive and desire. Most teams would be taking the easier defensive route by now. Tielemans. Tielemans stood his ground strongly. Luca Bacchio. Nice control. Belgium need to give it everything they have, kitchen sink included. Well, they've got it again. De Bruyne delivers. And there's his chance to lead the counter. Great defending, strong and determined. Vertonghen. So that's it, it is all over.